welcome to mathematics class first quarter of uh, week one division of the gig city and pateros school year 2021 to 2022 so our topic for today is about divisibility rules so divisibility rules of two three five six nine and ten so in this uh, video you're expected to use the visibility rules for 2, 5, 10 to find the common factors and use the visibility rules for 3, 6, 9 to find the common factors, okay? So let's have an exercise. So what's to look back? So give the first three multiples of the following number. So we have three given numbers. We have four, three, and five. So we're going to find the first three multiples of each number. So, paano nga ba natin nahanapin yung multiple numbers ng mga numbers na yan? So, we will just add the given numbers by themselves. So, for example, number one, we have four. So, let's add four. So it will become eight. And then plus four will become 12. And plus four will become 16. So these are the three multiples, the first three multiples of number four. Then we have number two. We have uh, number three, that's the given number. So we find the multiple, three plus three becomes six, plus three becomes nine, and plus three becomes 12. So 6, 9, and 12 are the first three multiples of number 3. All right. And then we have last number. We have number 5. So let's add sa sarili niya. So 5 plus 5, we have 10. Plus 5, we have 15. And plus 5, we have 20. So 10, 15, and 20 are the first three multiples of 5. Okay, so yung exercise na ito makakatulong kung paano ba natin mahanap ng mas mabilis or, malalam, or masasabi natin niya yung number na yun is divisibility by 2, 3, 6, 5, 9, and 10. Okay, so let's answer this exercise now. So what will I do? Direction. Read and understand the mathematical problem in the box and answer the question that follow. Write your answer on the space provided. So Jaira has 90 collected stamps. Can she share that equally to two friends, five, 10? How about three friends, six, or nine friends? Okay, so dyan lalabas yung divisibility of two, five, 10, three, six, and nine. So the first question, how many collected stamp does Jaira have? So based on the problem, Jaira has 90 collected stamps. Yeah. What does the problem ask you to find? So here's the problem. Can you share that equally to two, five, 10, three, six, nine friends equally? And how will you find the answer to the problem? That's the time na lalabas na yung divisibility rules of two, three, five, six, nine, and 10, okay? So how can she equally share them if she has two friends, five friends, 10 friends? At the same time, how about if she has three friends, six friends, or nine friends, okay? So here's the solution how. So to solve the problem, you need to know if two, three, five, six, nine, 10 are factors of 90. If 90 is divisible by two, three, five, six, nine, and 10. So to determine if a number is divisible by 2, 5, and 10, the test by checking the ones digest, okay? So ito yung tinatawag natin ng trial and error. So we need to test by checking the ones digit. Ano ba yung ones digit? Yan yung first number on the right side of a number, okay? So divisibility test by number 2 is the ones digit 0, 2, 4, 6, or 8. So sa given at your number na 90, yung last number niya or the ones number is 0. Kapag daw yung number na yun is 0, 2, 4, 6, or 8, it means to say that it's divisible by 2. Since the number is 0, so it means 90 is divisible by 2. Next, we have the second example, divisibility by 5. Is the ones digits zero or five? 
So, titignan natin yung given natin yung number, which is 90. Titignan natin yung once digit niya, which is 0. So, ayon sa sinabi dito, if 0, if the, if the ones or the number is 0 or 5, it's divisible by 5. Since the last number or the ones number is 0, it means 90 is divisible by 5. And then last, divisibility by 10 is the ones digit 0. Okay, tignan natin yung ones digit niya, 0. So it means to say that 90 is divisible by 10. It's a yes. And then next sample natin, divisibility test of 3. To determine if the number is divisible by 3, 6, and 9, test by checking the no ones digit. So ganun pa rin. I-check pa rin natin yung ones digit niya. Okay. So for this one, so by 3, divisible by 3 natin. So it's the sum of the digits multiple of 3. So yung given natin number, which is 90, we will just add the number. So 9 plus 0 is equals to 9. Kapag yung answer na yun is divisible by 3, it means to say that the number is divisible by 3. Since the answer is 9 and it's divisible by 3, it means to say that 90 is divisible by 3. It's a yes. And then another one, divisibility rule by 6 naman tayo, is the number divisible by 2 or 3. Okay? So 90, that's the number. Is it divisible by 2? 45, exactly. 90 divided by 3 is equals 30. So this 90 is divisible by both 2 and 3. Ibig sabihin parehas dapat ha. If the number is divisible by 2, pero hindi si divisible by 3, it means it's not divisible by 6. If the number is divisible by uh, 3, pero hindi naman siya divisible by 2. Hindi pa rin siya. It should be both. It should be divisible by 2 and divisible by 3. Yung kanyang, uh, yung number na yun. So that the number could be divisible by 6. So it's a yes. And then last, divisible by 9 is the sum of the digits multiple of 9. So again, the sum of the digits, we will add 90. So 9 plus 0 equals 9. Divide 9 equals 1. So this is equals number. Walang sobra. It means to say that 90 is divisible by 9. It's a yes. So in the short the introduction here, what does it mean? So therefore, a number is divisible by 2 if a number ends with 0, 2, 4, 6, and 8. Or the ones number. And then a number is divisible by 5 if it ends with 0 and 5. And then a number is divisible by 10 if it ends with 0. Always remember. And a number is divisible by 3 if the sum of the digit is multiple of 3. And then a number is divisible by 6 if it is divisible both by number 2 and number 3. And then a number is divisible by 9 if the sum of the digit is multiple of 9. Okay, so let's have another exercise. So this exercise, what's more to do? So direction, put a check on the blank if each number is divisible by the first given number. So we have three numbers here. We have three exercises. We have number 2, which is 1. Uh, number 1 is which is 2. Number two, we have five. And number three, we have 10. So we have the given numbers as well. So just check down natin kung alin sa mga given numbers na to, yung mga yan, ang divisible dun sa numbers sa left side. So first one, number one, divisible by two. Pag divisibility rules by two class, we need to know um, the ones number. If it is zero, two, four, six, eight. Kapag yun ang the ones niya, it means divisible by two siya. The second effect number. So the ones is four. So meaning it's checked. This one, the ones is one. So hindi siya zero, two, four, six, eight. It means hindi siya divisible by two. Okay? And then next one, 244, the yan, and niya is four. Zero, two, four, six, eight. Kasama pa rin siya doon. So it means it's divisible by two. So napakadali lang. Tingnan lang natin kung yung number ba is, yung dulo niya or ones number is 0, 2, 4, 6, 8. Pag walang nabanggit dyan, kagaya nito, 1 siya, it means hindi siya divisible by 2. Let's move to the next exercise. Uh, to the next question. We have number, uh, given number is 5. So pag 5 naman siya, tingnan natin ulit yung ones number. If the ones number is 0 or 5, 
Yan, it means divisible siya by 5. So, number 1, ang 1 siya is 0. It means divisible siya by 5. Number 2, 3,924. Yung dulo niya is 4. Hindi siya 0, hindi siya 5. It means hindi siya divisible by 0, by 5. And then last, 4,435. Yung dulo niya is 5. So, it means to say divisible siya by 5. Kasi yung dulo niya, is 0 or once niya is 0 and 5. And then last, number 10. Kapag number 10 naman, titignan natin once number niya, kapag yung once niya or last number niya is 0, it means divisible siya by 10. So number 1, 0 in dulo niya, it means yes. Number 2, 2, it means no. And then number 5, uh, number 3 is 5, it means no pa rin. So tandaan natin, kapag divisible by 10, it should be and at zero or once number niya should be zero no other number zero lang dapat kagaya nito 120 ito 422 it means not x ito naman 235 5 siya it means n. this is the only answer okay so things to remember class always remember um, a number is divisible by 2 if a number ends with 0 2 4 6 8 and then a number is divisible by 5 if it ends with 0 and 5 and a number is divisible by 10 if it ends with 0 and a number is divisible by 3 if the sum of the digits is multiple of 3. So a number is divisible by 6 if it is um, both divisible by 2 and 3 and last a number is divisible by 9 if the sum of the digits is multiple by 9. Okay, so I think that's all for today. So if you learn from this video, kindly hit click, like, share, and subscribe, and see you on my next video. Bye.